Hey everybody, this is Mr. V and this is Apes Review video topic 9.3 on the greenhouse effect. So when we're looking at the greenhouse effect, um, this is basically going to be something that is pretty clear. There are several gases to think about, right? And this results in the um, earth being warm enough for life to survive. So there's several gases um, such as water, carbon dioxide, methane, uh, nitrous oxide, and CFCs. These are going to be the most potent are going to be the CFCs and nitrous oxide and then your water vapor and your CO2 are going to be the least potent. The catch is carbon dioxide is the one that is the most abundant, so that's the one we focus on mostly when we talk about this. So if you take a look, the sunlight uh, does come in and heat the earth, and these molecules, what they'll do is they'll trap those heat rays and let them bounce back and forth between the earth and the atmosphere before they go back out into space. And of course, having more CO2 means that those um, particles of energy and heat will stay on the earth longer. So that's the greenhouse effect. So here's some more resources to help you uh, uh, learn about that. And hopefully that'll be helpful and hopefully this was. Thank you very much.